Hi and welcome back to Fishing with David Pyle. It's January 9th, 2021 and today I'm on the Willamette River doing catch and release sturgeon fishing. Um, I've got some really good footage from this fall and early winter that I'm going to show you on this video. I'm also going to show you how and and why I rig up bait the way I rig it. So stay tuned, watch the video, and we'll see you next time on Fishing with David Pyle. Kind of make a little diagonal cut on my herring, and I can use front or back. Um, doesn't seem to be a preference for sturgeon either way. But with my hook, I've got the egg loop, which I pull, I'll pull out the egg loop just to show you. If I can get this thing out. And that just wraps around, in this case, the back of, of the fish or with a front piece, I'll just come through right below the gills, through the eye socket area. And then I wrap that egg loop around the bait, secure it, very simple. Um, I have friends that use whole herring and they do very well with that but this has several advantages as i said this hook is sticking out so if, when it comes up to sniff this food it generally gets hooked the first time uh, the second piece is you've got the inside of the fish all of that scent permeating down river so um, hopefully having a cut piece of herring has more scent going down river because sturgeon obviously um, are scent hunters they're not visual hunters so that's it we'll cast this in the water and we'll wait and hopefully we have another fish soon that's my tips wrap a little nice to have it out a little ways away from the boat so you have some line angle any uh, swing of the boat that way you're not dragging your bait across the bottom as much um, that's it put it in the rod holder and go relax inside the boat enjoy your day wait for a fish to come along that's a fish on right there camera one was sleeping on the job. This is already hooked. I don't really even have to set it. Come up back here. There it is. Nice. Nice little guy. Took a piece of herring and that herring had just a little bit of bloody tune on it. So Made a turn. Look at the bubbles up there. Yeah, we're gonna see them here pretty quick. There, there he is. Oh, wow. nice. good fish. Yeah. 
There he is. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Hey, we got pictures of him, bud. Take the rod butt and put it, you know, here. Yeah. And then if it's up here, it's really hard to reel that. So you keep it like this. Give yourself some leverage. Give you a little more slack to go. And just keep it from you want to kind of point the rod tip out here, keep it from going under the boat. There's your fish. Oh, oh, oh. oh my gosh. What do I do now? Okay, just hold on. I'll unhook him and then I'm going to have you hold on to him and get a picture of it, right? Oh. That's a There's your sturgeon. Keep going. Yeah. 